Ah, ah, I'm back from the dead. <sighs> I'm back. YouTube, I am back. Yay yeah, is back to get these sports videos out, man. My bad, I'm watching Young and Pregnant. That's my show. Chill out on me. Uh, it's been a month. A month. All I'm saying is, my bad. I'm been, I've been busy. I've been gone for a month. Um, I've been filling out job application after job application after job application. You know, I'm really trying to get me this job so I can make this move. Um, trying to move to an apartment so I can scream as loud as I want making these videos and things like that so just give me time y'all I'm trying to you know and things like that but I'm still gonna ground out these videos for y'all or video depends on how I'm feeling we but first before we get into the video what's good YouTube welcome back to another video welcome back to another sports video welcome back to my channel even though I said that the other way around it's supposed to be the other way but whatever we have came to the commencement of the 2018 season of the NFL. We have graduates at the top of the class, top of the top of the class, New England. We have graduates, summa cum laude. We have the, we got the Rams, the Saints, the Bears, the Eagles, the Chargers, the Chiefs, the Ravens, the Seahawks. We got the, the Cowboys. And then we have our people who barely made it. Yeah, my team, the Lions included in that, but hey. What a season, man. What a run through. What a, I don't know what to call it. That Super Bowl, it might not have been the prettiest, but that was the defensive show. Now, I enjoyed myself. The Patriots won, Brady got a six. A lot of people be, is hating to this day. Talking about, we already know the real Super Bowl happened between the Rams and Chiefs. If y'all want to see 50-point games, go ahead. Go to the college or whatever. This is the NFL. We came here to see prolific defenses. Not every Super Bowl is going to be a high-scoring affair. That's what people need to realize. But it's whatever. Uh, yeah, so New England Patriots are champions. Once again, people are hating and I'm a Lions fan, and I'm not going to hate because I like Tom Brady. So, yeah. But, Lions, we need to get it together. Like, for real, bro. We need to get it together, bro. Um, For this season, uh, we got the, we got our normal people schedule. I don't know what the schedule is. I kind of forgot. I need to look over it. But we got our normal schedule. Um... We have, hold on. Oh, I'm back. <laughs> I was sorry that the scene got 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 interesting. But I was saying, um, Lions. Um, yeah. Um, what do we have? Uh, we got our regular people. We got the Vikings, of course, two times. We got the Green Bay, two times. And Bears, We come see us. Come see us, Bears. I'm not mad because of the sweep because we swept y'all like three years in a row. So y'all got y'all little sweet revenge back. But all I'm saying is come see us. I heard somebody on the Bears said that the Thanksgiving game, I guess we got them again this Thanksgiving. They talking about this going to be an easy W. Humble yourself, young man. Because about a year ago, you wasn't in that position. Y'all were 4-12, and 12, if I can remember. Y'all only won four games last year. So humble yourself, brother. Okay, y'all was 12 and 4 this year for the first time in 
since y'all been to the Super Bowl or whatever, humble yourself. Because that 12 and 4 can switch to 4 and 12 easily. If you don't believe me, ask the Falcons. Because they was in the Super Bowl two years ago. Now look at them. Came and reached the second round to save their life or playoffs. So humble yourself. Yeah, that 12 and 4 is good. But don't write us off like we just, we suck. Because this is the same lands that gave y'all fits a year ago. Let's not get it twisted. And y'all was 12 and 4, but y'all still got booted out the fucking... Excuse my language. Y'all still got booted off the face of the earth by the Eagles. Everybody picked y'all to go to the Super Bowl of sleeper, and y'all got booted. So calm yourself, young man. But anyway, but Bears come see us. That's all I'm saying. But anyway, and I think I read that we got the Chiefs. Ah, <laughs> we got the Chiefs. Uh, but we got my Patricia, Matt Patricia, and. He comes up with great defensive plans for the Chiefs, you know. It's not for the Chiefs, but for anything. So, I, I have no worry. All we got to do is double-team Tyreek Hill. Contain Patrick Mahomes. Keep him inside that pocket. But don't let him have him think. Don't let him just sit in the pocket. Um, that's going to be... A game to watch. Um, some of us, I don't know. I think we got the Chargers. I think we got Saints. Yo, to be honest, I don't even know the schedule. But I do know that we got the Chiefs. That's the one thing. That's the one thing that caught my eye. This Chiefs and Pat Mahomes. So we got to get on that, Lions. We have to get on that. You know, I value and I predict a 10 and 6 season. If not a 10 and 6, 11 and 5 season. I'll go for 10 and 6 because y'all gave away Golden Tate to the Eagles. I don't know why will Bob Quinn do that. That's still. But I predict a 10 to 6 season. You know what I mean? I predict that. A 10 to 6 season. We will turn it around. We will reverse our record, make it 10 to 6. Maybe we'll pitch for 11 to 5. We will be in, probably in a wild card again. And, you know, we need to win our first playoff home. We need to win our first playoff game in over 20 years. Like, that, that come on, we, we got to do that. But, you know, we got our weapons back. I keep I keep I keep saying Golden Tate because he was our best receiver, but I forgot that we got we getting Marvin Jones back, and we got Kenny Galladay, and that's a duo threat right there. Uh, you know I think Kenny Galladay is gonna be extra motivated because he got left out of the Pro Bowl this year. I don't know why he had over a thousand yards receiving. He basically backpacked the whole offense when. Marvin Jones went out, and when Golden Tate got um, tr traded, the only person that made Pro Bowl is Darius Slay, and he always comes through for us. But Matthew Stafford haven't made it, and I don't see how. I think I heard Aaron Rodgers made it, and he didn't have his best season, but he didn't show up at the Pro Bowl. Nobody really showed up at the Pro Bowl, even Drew Brees. That lets you know that stuff that happened in New Orleans, Drew Brees is mad because when have you ever known Drew Brees not to show up at a Pro Bowl, not unless he in the Super Bowl. So, some some stuff coming from next year, but Lions, let's get this together. If you if you my, if you a Lions fan, predict the season, tell me what y'all think need to happen. Who we, Who do we need to draft? I forgot the draft coming up. Who we need to draft? More on defense. I'm tired. I'm tired of getting defensive players and they not stacking up. Bum it. But anyway, yo Lions fan, tell me what need to happen. Tell me what Matt Patricia need to do and tell me how we can get this offense going. Tell me.
But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe. And if you want another video, hey, comment down below, man. Comment down below. Tell me what you want. You know, it's Young Ye. I'm back. Hopefully for good. But if y'all don't see me in the month again, I probably got a job. Just letting y'all know. And peace.